Okay, now we've adjusted our lifting arm. We've slid the inner tube out to where our pick point is over uh, our pivot point and chain attaching lug so we get the, a vertical lift. And we're going to adjust the chain so that we don't have all this slop here with the chain laying on components, uh, perhaps getting into the uh, angle cylinder fitting. We're going to adjust the chain so it has uh, just enough uh, slack in it to be able to let the plow float if you hit a uh, depression, for example, to go down and get the snow out of the depression. And also we don't need to have the chain uh, so tight and so short that it's going to lift uh, excessively high. All we need is about a 12-inch cutting edge lift pipe off the ground. So we'll adjust this chain. It has too much slack. We'll adjust it up so it has a comfortable number of links here. Two, four, six, seven, okay, and this will improve our level lifting performance quite a bit because now as you angle, one chain doesn't need to grow in length relative to another. So we'll have Ken fire up the truck and angle it from side to side.